So, um, my man said, yeah, quote us, uh, you know, gave me the quote number. I said, man, that's pretty damn high, man. I said, all right, man, whatever. I said, I'll tell you what, man, give me a 10% discount, I'll give you one. Mm -hmm. And so, um, yeah, got the discount approved, started. They didn't have the parts, so that somebody had to sh ship them. He's in the attic getting going. I said, wait a minute, man. Yeah. I'll walk, man, and see, yeah. see if, you know, what's mm -hmm. going on here, right? Yeah. So I called the office, said, have my man come out the other house. And he's like, was it Walter? Yeah, it was Walter. I said, have him give me a call. Mm -hmm. You called me. I said, they quote this out for me. He sent me the quote. I'm like, something off, man. Yeah. I said, hey, man, I got a quality guy. Mm -hmm. And here's my quote from him. What am I getting paying you mm -hmm. extra money? Just explain it to me. And you're a um, <laughs> uh, you, uh, maintenance Premium customer. Uh, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. I said, so... Explain me what I'm getting yeah. out of this. Mm -hmm. If I'm getting more, then fine. Give me, let me know what I'm paying for. Yeah. He called the office call, office call back. No, sir, we, you're a reputable company. We're a larger company. All this kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Pack your stuff up, man. Get out. Yeah. <laughs> you know, <laughs> that's yeah. not nothing, man. Yeah. yeah. My man is good. Like, he just solved a problem at Mother House. Mm -hmm. I know he's knowledgeable. Yeah. He seems yeah. responsible. He's yeah. on top of his game. Yeah. I'm not paying you extra money, man. Just yeah. for the name. Yeah. Uh, I say, nah, <laughs> man. Not only that, not another name, but you know, they they got a lot of technicians. They got commercials that they got to pay. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? They overhead. It's you know, higher. It's, it's, yeah. a, it's a lot higher than mine. So I can kind of, like I say, trust me. If I want, like I say, I'm reputable. You know, yeah. we don't, I don't have no tail light warranty or anything yeah. like that. Yeah. And at the end of the day, this is my company, yeah. and I trust me, I can work for that company. Yeah. <laughs> you yeah. know what I mean? I could be their technician yeah. any day of the week. Yeah. But I, <laughs> you know I'm like, I'm not, I'm like yeah. I've seen yeah. his work. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Like, I'm not just talking like my man know what he's doing. Right. So, you yeah. know, yeah. you got to give me more than just your name. Yeah. I said, man, pack your stuff, man. I'm going to get on out. Yeah. Now, nah, I appreciate you giving me the opportunity, though, yeah. for sure. Yeah. Anyway, All right. Man, so I, I see this one not plugged. Yeah. Like that, that was there when I bought the house. Yeah, okay, okay. I'm thinking about taking this out. It, it's unplugged. You don't need it. And then, uh, same spot. Yeah. yeah, we can use that same spot. Like I said, if you want to leave it, I can put it up front, but okay. I, I, I already kept this. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let me take a look at the other one before we start. Yeah, I can put a blanket down. You got one? It's going to have insulation coming down there. Yeah, yeah I, got got a, I got a blanket. Yeah, I'll take care of it. All right. I'll be off this one. Okay, then. All right. Let me know if you need anything also. Hi. Hello. All right, it's back, people. Hey, got some air scrubbers to install. Three air scrubbers, so we're going to get at it. Work to do for me. Install some drain pans. I already installed two. Got to install three more. Look like it. All right. So on this job here, I think I come back and get what I need. I need my drill. Yeah, I'll come back and get all that. I'm gonna see if I gotta cut in some duct work. My cutters. Yeah. All right, so we put our blanket down. So I got three ash scrubbers. One, two. change the filter but they just leave the filter all right so as you can see these so I might just better use the pre-existing hole on this honey well let's see how it's installed I'm gonna have to get a knife cut around there all right, so I got one right there. I'm gonna use that pre-existing hole. I'm gonna have to make it bigger. I'm gonna get them filter down for them. I'm gonna have to pull around and take this customer, man. I'm like, man, they just leave the filters up here like that when they change them out. Right. Yeah, man. 
thing. So we're gonna we're gonna do this one first. This is gonna be easy. All right, these back people. So the first thing I think I want to do is install the transformer. transformer on here the last night you be like they had uh, got that socket right there which I probably I could make a plug if I wanted to and just plug it up right there but we're gonna put a transformer on here We need 115 volts. All right. All right, so I'm gonna try to find power to this furnace to turn the power off. And I'm gonna find 115. Let's see 115 right here. If I can find an incoming power source. There's the incoming power right here. Alright, so I'm just gonna mount my transformer. So since there's a little ribbit hole right here, I can use this right here. Ain't gonna be no problem. We can uh I'm gonna use that right there. Let's see. Voltage. All right. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and mount it on the inside because that's not gonna reach. Well, it might reach. I can mount it right here and just hook mine up right here. And that'll reach. Yeah, oh yeah, that's plenty right there. So make sure I got this wire right. So black and white, 24 volts. Hold on. All right, so I had to take a phone call, but all I did was pierce this line right here. And this is my black wire right here. Just gonna add that in there. That white one. This one. All right, get my 115 volt. I just put all this back in here. Yeah. Oh, I messed up one thing, so I got to take this back out first. this through here.
right, got that. That look good. So on this here. Plus the self tap in here. four volts right here this will go to the air scrubber all right so I take take the air scrubber here Take this car off. Up. All right. So I'm gonna peel this tape here off and stick it out. go back with a piece of uh it's pretty good though if we want we can go back with a piece of four tape all right well all this going to do is just stick right down in here there's my cone right here i want to put it this way there we go. Looks good.
So it should take you less than an hour to install all three of these. Like I said, I, I may not have much over here at the other company, but I mean, on some instances, like I told this guy here on the phone, if it was in the summertime, I'm busy. I probably charge the same thing sometime. But, uh, especially since he got three of them, though, I cut them a little deal. I ain't gonna try to get full price for all three of them like they did. Man, he got a membership with him. All my membership customers, I, I get 15% off also. That's good and secure right there. I'm gonna need these accessories right here. Um, just put them right here just in case. Need to get a new plenum one day. And I'm gonna go back with that cut board. I ain't need to make all your doors like this. This end right here. Unravel this. Alright, All right, so that just plugged in on the back of here somewhere. So far, this should cut down on the allergy. Especially when you got one on all three units. Cut all the dust particles. Highly recommend. Alright. Bam. So 24 volts right here. on that return right there so we'll got the uh, serial number on there I was on free that's fine right there all right gonna fire it up should have a blue light yep. got our blue light 
working. When your fan turn on, we be cleaning the air. Y'all see the blue light? Feel pretty good, but I think before I leave, I come back when I finish all of them, put some little foil tape on there. I just don't like the look of that foil tape, so we're gonna make sure we put it down right. You see how this ends up looking. All right, that was easy. See, one of them I think cut open. Across the way, I'm gonna take them with me. See if anything wrong with the bugs or something. How's it going up there? Uh, pretty good. We, we got one installed. You wanna come take a look? Yeah. All right. All right. Get this way right here. Yeah. And then I'm gonna step over there and. Uh, Get started on this one. Yeah. All right. Yep. So it's already on. Yeah. Yep. So, so this your ass scrub over here. Uh. So this wire here, this a transformer right here. So if anything uh, short out or anything, it won't affect the unit because it has its own transformer on here. You got two transformers here. Now you got one for the system that's on the control board. Right. If anything happened to this, it won't show out that control board. Perfect. Yep. Right. Yep. And then it's just need to be, I guess it's just sealed up. Sealed so up I too. am going to seal it, but it's, it is sealed pretty good. When I finish all of them, I'm going to go back around and put duct tape, but it is sealed pretty good. Uh, I'm going to leave these screws right here. Yeah. Just in case you need a new plenum one day. Okay. Um, and it's probably going to go back with metal. And then we can... I always use those screws to drill drill in there. Um, mm -hmm. And this is the one you recommended, right? With the UV light. Oh yeah. That's the one you're talking about. Yeah, oh yeah, 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 yeah. That's the aerospace one. Um, I'm gonna leave these up here because it has a serial number on here, just in case uh, the warranty. But you can take one of these booklets. You can take this one right here, and it give you a lot more information on it. This one, this one here also. And, and then the other ones I'll just leave inside the box, uh, uh, inside the unit. Again, man, allergies, yeah. asthma, mm -hmm. you know, all these fish tanks, man. I'm just trying to get the air quality right here. Yeah, yeah, it should be good now because those things are very good. Um, I see the filter. Um, you know, they changed the filter? Yeah, so I know. Do you change the filter or they change it? I changed it. So okay. uh, I know uh, last time we talked, mm -hmm. I think you said get a thin filter at the return not here did you say it right um as, as, as a recommendation i got a i got a, i used to have thick ones this is a yeah. pretty thin one mm -hmm. so i did that because of our conversation but what, what yeah. do you what do you what is your best recommendation like i say i prefer airflow but oh, yeah. uh but especially since you have an allergy problem yeah let's try to air scrub first yeah and then uh, and then uh maybe go with the thinner filter okay but since y'all have a bunch of allergy probably i would go with the thicker media filter okay then. okay all right here yeah, right yeah, at the return here. Here. Yeah, okay. yeah, because it, it's easy. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, you just get up here and just change that one out. And then you just change those out every, every uh, twice a year, every yep. six months. Yep. 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 Although these are not, I don't think I got quite I prefer the honey well, though. Yeah, but the best quality on these, man. Yeah. For yeah. Them Amazon. So. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, they decent, though, but I prefer the ones you had in there. Yep. The honey oh, well, because oh. uh, I don't think about these since they don't, they don't fit right, you'll have uh, air going around them. You know, because they it don't fit right. Um, yeah, because you see, it should tell you on here. Yeah, see the uh, model number right here. Oh, okay, that's the. Okay. Yeah, you probably take a picture of that. The FC one hundred A ten thirty seven. Okay, so that's the model filter. Yeah, that's that they the, want here. Yeah, Honeywell. Yeah, that filter. Yeah, 
Because you won't have no air getting around there. Okay. This right here really not the right side. Okay. This is, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. This this wasn't even working. Is this even on? That one wasn't even in there. I'm uh. Do you want them? I take them. Yeah. Yeah. I take them and uh, troubleshoot them and see if they work or whatever. But I don't think they work. That one wasn't even in there though. It's probably the bulb just blown. But those really ain't no good. Those those just regular UV lights. Like I say, they, the air scrub for you hospital the quality air, so. Do you do um, exhaust fan replacements? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. I'm going to have another job for you. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yep, so I'm going to take this one here. Huh? As a matter of fact, it's, it's, uh, it's got a bathroom exhaust. Huh? conversation but hey we're gonna get an exhaust fan installed at this too all this come from a warranty company if you call my live we we're talking about a little bit on my way up here but my phone died my line got cut short
Do, 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 do. Mm. Trying to use the pre existing hole, but I'm just kind of going to get my, my cutters and just cut me a bigger hole. So let's see, three inch.
too bad. So I'm going to go ahead and do it. But. but you don't need it.
my same unit, so we do the same thing. This one up underneath, so sometimes get a little different application, folks. So you gotta make do. I'm gonna kill the power. Check the power. All right. So I was looking for what I did with the transformer. Right, same thing, got our transformer here. I'm down here, right here. So I'm gonna put my 24 volts right there. Block the blower cabinet. In this case, you got to troubleshoot that blower motor.
scratch. Two down, two to go. Well, one to go. Twenty four volts. All right, and it's out the way just in case you need to put a transformer or put a blower motor or something. Got to think about your fellow technicians wanting to come behind you, folks. Come the engineer. I know some people would have ran that another, ran it another way, but one, one way to skin a cat, make that look professional. So we're going to gain power. Bam. Got our blue light. All right, folks, that's two of them, though. So keep keep this video where it won't be too long. But almost. Sometimes a video will be long, folks. But thanks for everybody for watching. Uh, also, I'm going to put some. Go ahead and there since he asked about it. Really don't need it. But uh, like I say, man, everybody, thanks for watching, though, tuning in. I'm going to go install this other one, then see what it's going to take to put my upgrade is ventilation system in the bathroom. i to add more CFM. So these bugs last three to five years. So I don't want to take take this up. Come try to change it up. Um, they don't need no poop yet now. No.
like I said, I'm gonna do the same thing to the other one. Like I said, I'm gonna cut, cut this video short. I'm going to uh, everybody, thanks for watching. Hey, thanks for subscribing, hit that like button. Hey, posting videos all the time, and I'll be going live sometime. Hope I can drop some uh, gems, be motivational, uh, inspire some people to get in this ace back trade, or even continue to be in the ace back trade. I know it can be ups and down roller coasters, but all right, hit that notification. You'll get alerts when we do drop live. But see if I can upgrade that fan for them. And uh, maybe we go with a different style. See what's going on over there. So I can look back at this too. See what's going on. Maybe get a go with a four inch and three inch reducer going out of there. But I don't mess with the uh with the uh forgot what y'all call them thing. And look at this one right here. This one used to go somewhere. It's detached. I'm going to make sure he ain't talking about this one because he ain't removing no air. If uh, I have to look into that, yeah, I'm disconnected somewhere. All right, folks, we out, though.